Miscarriage, also referred to as spontaneous abortion, is defined as the unintentional termination of pregnancy before 20 weeks of gestation. It is a relatively common occurrence, affecting approximately 10 to 20 percent of all pregnancies, with the risk increasing as maternal age advances. The process of miscarriage can be classified into four stages based on the presentation of symptoms and findings from investigations. Threatened miscarriage. This is the initial stage characterized by vaginal bleeding without cervical dilation or any significant changes in cervical consistency. The bleeding may be mild and there is typically no notable abdominal pain, although mild cramps may be present. The cervical OS remains closed and ultrasound usually confirms an intrauterine pregnancy. Threatened miscarriages are more frequent in the first trimester. Inevitable miscarriage. In this stage, there is vaginal bleeding accompanied by cervical dilation. The bleeding is often more pronounced compared to a threatened miscarriage. Although no tissue is passed at this stage, an ultrasound may show the products of conception situated in the lower uterine segment. Incomplete miscarriage. This stage involves significant vaginal bleeding, cervical canal dilation, and the passage of some products of conception. The bleeding tends to be heavier, and abdominal cramps become more severe. An ultrasound may reveal retained products of conception within the uterus. Complete miscarriage. In this final stage, a patient will have a history of vaginal bleeding, abdominal pain, and the passage of tissue. Once all the tissue has been expelled, abdominal pain and vaginal bleeding usually subside. Examination findings include a closed cervical OS and some blood in the vaginal vault, while the ultrasound will show an empty uterus. There is no uterine, cervical, adnexal, or abdominal tenderness. It is important to note that not all miscarriages progress through these stages in a typical sequence. Such cases are referred to as missed miscarriages, where a non-viable intrauterine pregnancy remains within the uterus without any symptoms like vaginal bleeding, abdominal pain, or passage of tissue. The most common cause of miscarriage is fetal genetic abnormalities. Other contributing maternal factors include the following. Advanced maternal age, structural anomalies of the reproductive system, such as congenital uterine defects, uterine fibroids, or cervical incompetence. Hormonal imbalances, Infections, including rubella, cytomegalovirus, toxoplasmosis, listeria, HIV, dengue, and brucellosis. Polycystic ovarian syndrome. Uncontrolled diabetes mellitus. Renal disease. Untreated thyroid disorders. And high blood pressure. Additionally, external factors like smoking, alcohol consumption, cocaine use, and high caffeine intake can increase the risk of miscarriage.